What vision of loveliness! Carolinzo! Carolinzo! Let down your hair! Sorry, my dear! I'm afraid it's not long enough! You're gonna have to climb! Shit! But my love, it's just too hard, and I have no chalk. What am I to do? You do shit. Go away. Practice. You'll come back when you're worthy of me. Amongst boulderers and climbers around the world, Baffa is an almost legendary place. It's uh, an endless ocean of granite boulders, rock as far as the eye can see. On the first day, uh, I think we both got really positively surprised by the boulders, actually. It was like, first moment, amazement, slight disillusion, and then back to really happiness. The word disappointed is probably too strong uh, to describe our impressions of Baffa. I would more say disillusioned. You see so much rock and you imagine that there is so much potential, but yet actually when you get out there and start exploring, you realise that there's perhaps just a fraction of, uh, of the possibilities you first imagined. Maybe that's the key for Baffa, exploring. One of our other reasons for going to Baffa was to search out some trad climbing. Trad climbing is a really important part of my history and it's also become an important part of Caroline's day-to-day -day climbing life as well. So not only uh, did we want to climb above the crash pads but also uh, above the gear, the friends and the nuts as well. Towards the end of the guidebook there are one or two other sections that apparently have a different rock to the, the rough granite of Baffa and uh, we decided to go and check this out one day to see if it was true. Kara Hayat is supposed to be uh, more mountainous, similar to the rock that you get in Switzerland. It sounded too good to be true, but it was definitely worth checking out. James, James was getting very excited. <laughs> but then uh, we arrived and we walked. So in reality, we spent about two or three hours traipsing around this mountainside. I think we walked all the way up. At that point, we had both forgotten the idea of finding the boulders. We were just uh, aiming for a giant white boulder, which boing, 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 turned out proper shit. So we gave up all hopes of climbing and started to come back down a different road down the mountain. And lo and behold, we found the original spot. Ta -da! And uh, there were three boulders. Yeah, <laughs> just three boulders, but three nice boulders. Actually, we did one. It was cool. You even did a project. Yeah, a small little wall with a with a dino. It was, it was fun. Yeah. But uh, well, I don't know if that's exactly for that that you go on exploration. But you definitely go on exploration to be surprised, no? Yeah, and you always I need think, to be prepared. I think we got our share of uh, ups and downs. Well, mainly downs on these few days. But uh, well, the downs just make you appreciate the ups when they when it turns out really good. Okay, so I'm definitely hoping for a big up next time, okay? No. You no, promise? No problem, I promise.